welcome to Becky's Toy Collection. Today I'm going to do an unboxing of this Sylvania family. So it's been quite a while since I got a new family. I think I got a few when I was in Berlin in August, so it's been a super long time. And that's because we don't get a lot of new, not all of the new families here in Sweden. And most stores only have like maybe 10 different families at, mo at most, and that's like the super big like Toys R Us, they may, may, might have 10 different ones, so we don't get a lot of the families here, so... But I did find this and it was on sale, so I got it for like uh, 9 or 10 euros, depending on the course rate or the exchange rate. So, um, and this is actually not a new family, but I never got it because I wasn't like a huge fan of it. And the families can get pretty pricey and they have a race day price on it. So now like most families are like 24 or 25 euros. So getting this for a half price is awesome. So you can see these are the old boxes. The new ones are like beige color and super cute. And in the back you kind of can see a photo of a lot of the families. So it's a super cute photo with a lot of different ones. You get the elephants and you got a lot of the bunny, koalas and sheep and bears. So that's super cute. And also I think some of the new boxes has the family story. Like you get to know the, the characters' names and such. But the old one doesn't. But these uh, not the ones here in Sweden. But I have found them online, so um, I will read them after I've taken them outside of the box. So I unbox all of my Sylvania families. Let's see. Get out. Uh, when I started collecting, I did not because I did not have room to display them all. So I only unboxed like maybe three or four to, ha four to have in my house and such. But then I cleared out the whole shelf and now I have them all lined up. Uh, I did do a Sylvanian figure collection video uh, lot this fall, so if you want to check that out, I will leave a link to that. So I do have quite a lot of families, but I, I do hope that we get some new ones here in Sweden soon. Otherwise I will have to wait until I go on vacation. I do want to go to London this uh, this year since I didn't go last year, so maybe I can get some new ones then. So, uh, what I like about the Slovenian families is that it's super easy to get them out of the package. Uh, they all, they're held down by these strings, so it's super easy and you just slide it out. And all of the boxes comes with this little pamphlet with all the different sets. And but since this is an older set, so uh, there won't be any of the new sets, so it will be some of the older ones. And that's pretty fun too, because you can see the uh, different families. So I do have a lot of these, but um, there are a lot of that I don't have, so... And there are a lot that I want to have, so I hope I will find some in the future. So let's take a quick look at the figures. So we can f start off by the dad in the family. And I will read what it says online. So this is Father Slick Slidale. I think that's their last name. That you That's how you pronounce it, but I'm not sure. And Father Slick Slidale is a mine of information and very clever. He will know the answer to any question you ask him. So uh, I think it's super cute that they do have these kind of little information. Sometimes it, it's about what they do for a living and sometimes about their personalities and such. So... Uh, you kind of can see there's a bit different to the new clothes styling that I have, but I think this is super cute too. You got this uh, blue pants and this little, I don't know if it's supposed to be a tie, but uh, probably. And this strapped sweater. And he has this super cute little fuzzy tail. And he does have a bit of an imprint on the fuzzy or the flocking of him because he's been in the box for so long, so he's kind of squished. And he has these whiskers, and his face is actually super cute. Uh, I do like them more but now that are, they are outside the box, and I can take a quick look at them. And I will take a quick look before I end this video and see, because I did collect ba only babies. Like, at first I had a few families, but mostly collected babies. So let's see if I do have 
uh, some fox babies you can, can take a little, little look at that too so that's the father and uh, I will just have to look it up on my phone so next is the mother and it says Mother Valletta Slidale is always on the lookout for a bargain. She has been known to travel for miles and miles and queue for hours and hours just for the spring sale. So that's super cute and I love her dress. It's got this uh, white with blue flower pattern and this yellow top and an apron. So it matches super nice. If you have seen some of my other Slovenian families, I kind of get annoyed when they don't match the family's outfit fit super well. And if you see on the brother, I am a bit so-so on his sweater, but I do like this. I like the, how they like do different style for the mothers, because I think that's what the most different is. How they do the dresses and how much lace there is and the apron and such. So other than that, she looks exactly the same as her husband. And both have fuzzy tails and I'm probably sure if you take the, their clothes off they will look the same. Uh, just the same as the, the children. I think they're the same too, just different clothes. Which is like good or bad because you, if you don't want brothers you can put them in girl clothes. Or if you want two mothers or two dads you can just take clothes from some other doll and you will have two mothers instead. And I know they do sell some clothing packs, but I'm not sure if they do it for the adult ones. Anyway, next up is the brother. And his name, this is Brother Buster Sla Sla Slidale. is a real handful. Everyone says his middle name is Trouble. He's not a bad boy. He's just a bit wayward. I don't know, know what that is. And naughty. So... He's a bit of a troublemaker, but the nice. So you can see uh, Buster is the only one in the family that has red in his outfit. So that's why I'm always a bit like, I do want them to like coordinate them so nicely. And some families are super coordinate, coordinated clothes, but he does have some blue in his sweater too. And he has the yellow pants and a blue button. So I think he's okay. Could have been better, I would have preferred not to have red in this outfit, but I do think people think some differently about that too. Kind of can see the pants style is a bit different to the new ones too, but other than that, he looks just like his mother and father. Fuzzy tail and everything. And he does have the bit of an imprint on the head. Next up is the sister, and her description is very short and I think a bit shallow, but... Uh, it says like this, Sister Scar Scarlet Sly Slydale spends hours brushing her tail and is very proud of its glossy, healthy condition. So she does have a cute uh, dress. I think the straps on her uh, dress is a bit too long, but I do think it's because of, of her tail. So this, maybe not, maybe just super long so it would be easy to take off and on, but kind of can see her tail here. Kind of can curve it, and it does have this uh, metal wire wire in it, so you kind of can uh, turn it different ways. And yeah, as I said, I think she looks exactly the same as her brother, so probably no different there in the face or anything. So I do like that, and her dress is super cute. I think the flower pattern, it's no, it's not quite as the mother's, but it has the same colors, so and some lace. So you can see if you compare it to the new families, uh, it's a bit different. So yeah, and here the families together. So I didn't have any of the babies. I ha I think I've like seen them in the store and thinking about getting them, but end up not getting them. So I don't have any of the babies, but I do like this family, and I'm super happy that I found it them and found it on sale, which is super awesome. Uh, that's like one of the good things about the Slovenians here in Sweden. They do have quite a lot of sales sometimes of the new sets and such and older sets. Uh, we don't have a wide range of Slovenian families here so that's a bit of a bummer but uh, yeah I do like these ones. So as you can see the whole family together the brother's sweater kind of stands off quite a lot. So I would have liked them to be like more unified and have like maybe could have some green in his sweater. But otherwise I think this is a cute family. 
uh, I know people are like to super particular with like what families they like and uh, like what animals they like but uh, yeah so I didn't like these ones at first but now that I got them I think they're super cute so let me know what you think of this family and kind of tell me what families do you, do you like do you like the bunnies do you like the cats do you like all different kinds I do like all different kinds I do have a lot of bunnies but uh, I'm actually not that into the bunnies because if there's something we get here in Sweden, we always get the bunny families and I do wish we could get some of the strange ones like the otters or uh, yeah, I don't know, like monkeys and mouse and such. So uh, yeah, let me know what you think of this video by leaving a comment down below and pressing the like button and if you want to see my latest uploads don't forget to subscribe and if you in if you check out my Instagram you will see some more photos of my toy collection I normally post photos every day so and uh, yeah thank you so much for watching I hope to see you next time bye